grade 10, welcome back to our virtual math class. And now we will be having lesson 2, the first kind of sequence which is the arithmetic sequence. So the arithmetic sequence is just one of the four kinds of sequences. We also have the geometric, the harmonic, and the Fibonacci sequence. So dito, focus muna tayo sa arithmetic sequence. So what are you expected to learn? Special learning competency for this lesson is the liner illustrate arithmetic sequence. So at the end of the lesson, you are expected to illustrate an arithmetic sequence. You should be able to determine which sequence is an arithmetic sequence or which is not. Okay, so let's do this. As a review of the previous lesson that we have discussed, regarding patterns and sequences, let's do this. Guess the next element. First, 8, 12, 16, 20, and 24. What do you think are the three next elements? What about the second one? 7, 16, 25, 34. And the last one, 5, 12, 1926. Can you guess the next elements? Let's try if you get it right. For the number one, the next element is 32. For the second one, the next element is 43. And for the last one, the next element is 33. So if you got it right, isang thumbs up naman dyan. Ayan. So let us define now what is an arithmetic sequence. An arithmetic sequence is a sequence where every term after the first is obtained by adding a constant called the common difference. So as you would see, naka-highlight yung constant. When we say constant, hindi nagbabago. Hindi nagbabago yung number. At yun yung number na yun, yung tinatawag nating common difference Okay So bago pa tayo lumalim sa discussion natin ng arithmetic sequence let us see if you could tell whether each sequence is an arithmetic sequence or not state why base dun sa ating definition kanina ng arithmetic sequence First 3 4 5 6 7 Next 3 5 7, 9, 11. Next. 2, 4, 8, 16, 32. Negative 1, 1, negative 1, 1, negative 1. And last one. 2, 9, 16, 23, and 30. Alin kaya sa limang yan ang arithmetic sequence at alin ang hindi? Have you answered already? Let us see if your answers are all correct. Number one is an arithmetic sequence. Titignan natin mamaya kung bakit. Number two is also an arithmetic sequence. Number three is not an arithmetic sequence. Number four is not an arithmetic sequence also. And the last one is an arithmetic sequence. Ganito kasi yung class, masasabi natin na isang arithmetic sequence ang isang sequence kung yung number na ini-add natin or isinusubtract natin is pare-pareho lang from the start to the end. Pero kapag nagkaroon na tayo ng process ng multiplication or division, let's say times 2, times 3, or divided by 2, that is not an arithmetic sequence anymore. Ibang klase na yun ng sequence. Ayan, tingnan nyo to. A sub N ang basa dyan. When we say A sub N, those are the elements or the terms in a sequence. N is the number of terms or the position of the sequence, of the term. Thus, a sub n equals 3n plus 1. Yun yung rule dun sa ating sequence na 4, 7, 10, 13. Kasi meron tayong common difference na 3. 3 times the n or yung position ng number plus 1 ang rule natin. 
So, 3 times 1 is 3 plus 1, kaya natin nakuha yung 4. 3 times 2 is 6 plus 1, kaya natin nakuha yung 7. 3 times 3 is 9, kaya natin nakuha yung 10. And 3 times 4 is 12, kaya natin nakuha yung 13. Next, find the first three terms of the sequences determined by the notations below. Kagaya nung ating notation kanina, 3n plus 1, let us try to find the next, the first three terms of the sequences determined by the notations below. a sub n equals n plus 4, a sub n equals 2n plus minus 1, a sub n equals 12 minus 3n, a sub n equals 3 raised to the n, and a sub n equals negative 2 raised to the n. So, ang gagawin natin, class, we will just substitute uh, 1, 2, and 3 to n para mahanap natin yung first three terms. Okay, for number 1, our answer will be 5, 6, and 7. Bakit? 1. Let's say substitute natin yung 1 sa n, so that is 1 plus 4, it will be 5. And then number 2, 2 plus 4, that is 6. And then 3 plus 4, that is 7. Kagaya din nung gagawin natin sa pangalawa. 2 times 1 is 2, minus 1 is 1. Ayan. 2 times 2 is 4, minus 1 is 3. Kaya natin nakuha yung 1, 3, and 5. For the third one, we have 9, 6, 3. Pababa siya kasi nagma-minus tayo. Number 4, 3, 9, 27. And number 5, negative 2, 4, negative 8. Pero, kung mapapansin ninyo, sa number 4 and number 5, hindi siya common difference. We are multiplying it. So, that is not an arithmetic sequence. Those two are not arithmetic sequences. Yung number 1, Number 2 at number 3 lamang ang masasabi nating arithmetic sequences. Malinaw na ba kung ano ang arithmetic sequence? Tingnan natin dito. Complete the arithmetic sequences below. Find the common difference. Ang common difference yun yung pagitan or interval ng dalawang element or dalawang terms. So let's try answering number 1. 3, 12, 21. The next number is 30 and followed by 39. So, paano natin nakuha yung 30 at 39? We have a common difference and our common difference here is 9. What about 8? 3, negative 2. So, pababa siya. Ano kaya yung ating sunod na number? Our next number is negative 7 followed by negative 12 and what is our common difference here negative 5 we are subtracting 5 kapag nag subtract tayo class that is negative number 3 5 12 and then can you guess 19 26 at ang huli 33 and what is our d 7. We are adding 7 after every number para makuha natin yung kasunod. Next, 2, blank, 20, 29, blank. So, the first blank is 11. And the last blank is 38. Bakit natin nakuha yun? We are adding 9. At yung huli naman, blank, 4, 10, 16, and blank. First blank is negative 2 and the last blank is 22. So what is our common difference here? We have 6. Ayan. So those are kinds of arithmetic sequences. As you can see, there is only one common difference for every sequence. Isang number lang yung nagiging pagitan ng bawat term sa sequence na yun. Ayan. For your performance task, Find the indicated term in each given arithmetic sequence. So, we already have four terms or three terms given. What you're going to do is find their indicated term. Number 1, 3, 7, 11, 15. And you are tasked to find the 9 term. 
ano kaya yung pang siyam na turn sa sequence na yon? Same with number 2, 11, 20, 29, 38, and you are tasked to find the 8th term. Number 3, 4, 7, 10, 13. Find the 15th term. Number 4, 9, 17, 25. Find the 10th term. And last number, 180, 60. Find the 9th term. And that's all for today, guys. I hope you learned something. Bye! See you in our next video lesson.